Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to the Nova Scotia Championship 2019 weekend number one here at the Canada Game Centre in Halifax, Nova Scotia. My name is Raisa Lalani, and I have got the call for you all weekend long. We've got some very exciting volleyball in front of us, and starting us off today here, we've got the 14U Boys Scotia Juniors Volleyball Club taking on the Tide Volleyball Club 14U team. On your screen, if you are looking at it, Closest to us is the Tide team, and on the far side of the screen in the green jerseys are the Scotia Juniors Volleyball Club. Thank you so much for tuning in. We hope you enjoy the game, and it looks like the referees are checking out the rosters, and we will be ready to go. Smiles all around. The head official, Morgan Snow, climbing up onto the referee stand and it looks like the Scotia Juniors are gonna start us off with a serve. That one just short of the net by Philip Cullen. Point going to Tide. Back on the Tide line here is number four, Bradley Hatfield with the serve. Big serve by Hatfield. Scotia Juniors looking to get a second touch but that is a service ace for Tide. Hatfield back to serve. A nice pass up from Bartlett, set in the middle, picked up by the hands of the Tide defense. Shot over from the middle as well for Tide. Tip over from Jack Kersey. A big swing past the double block there from Tide's Crow, but unfortunately that one going out of bounds on him. Point Scotia Juniors. Heading back to serve here now, Jeremy Curry. Spin serve, that one just hitting the top of the tape, point tied. Back on the line here now, the middle with the great swings, Isaac Crow, and an even greater serve. There's a service ace for Tide. Isaac Crow back to serve again. And that ball is passed up by Curry. A tip over from the left side. Tied with a big swing cross court, dug up by one arm. Free ball pushed over by Kiersey. Free ball over from Tides Field. A middle swing from the Scotia Juniors. A left side swing cross court and too much heat to handle. That is a tied point. Jack Maddie with the kill. Isaac Crow still back to serve. And that ball is passed up, set to the outside. A swing cross court there from left side, Adam Curry. That one just shy of the line, going out of bounds, point tied. Crow with the serve, that one hitting the top of the tape. Scotia Juniors with the point. Two serving six here in the early going of the first set. Back on the line, Jack Kersey. And that one just shy of the net, point tied. Heading back to serve here now, number five, Drew Williams. And that ball landing inside the court. The Tide guys pretty excited about that service ace. And he's gonna head back to the line to try and do it again, Drew Williams. That ball passed up by Cullen. And there's a big block in the middle from the Tide, a one-armed block reach from Alex Field.
Drew Williams back to serve. And a good try there by the Scotia Juniors to get a second touch, but that served too powerful, point tied. Williams back to serve. And it is a double contact call on that first pass, point tied. And that ball passed up and chased down, but another heated serve from the tied side. I mean, it looks like we are going to see a head, a timeout called here by head coach Neil Devaney as the tide climb away in the double digits, 12 to 2. Both teams back on the court. You are watching the Nova Scotia Championships 2019 Weekend 1 here at the Canada Game Center. The 14 new boys battling it out on the court. Scotia Juniors Volleyball versus Tide Volleyball Club. Tide racking up another ace there. Some big stats from Drew Williams on the line. Float serve, passed up beautifully by Cullen. Set to the back row. Tied with the dig. Another back row swing this time from Crow. And it looks like it is gonna land inbounds, point tied. Drew Williams back to serve. And that is a service ace. Williams with the serve, passed up by Cullen. A big back row attack from Jeremy Curry, but that one just going out of bounds, out the back point going to the Tide. Drew Williams with the serve. Cullen with the pass. That ball set over. Set out to the left side for Tide. A nice tip down the line, but unfortunately that one not finding the inside of the court for Jack Maddie. That's going to be a Scotia Juniors point. Adam Curry with the serve. And a swing from the front row. Eric Fields with the big swing there. And that is going to score and be a point for the Tide side. Heading back to the line now is your captain of the Tide volleyball team. This is number eight, Jack Matty. And that one just shy of the tape. Point Scotia Juniors. Heading back to the line here now for the Scotia Juniors, Dimitri Kariakis. And a big serve there, service ace for Scotia Juniors and Kariakis. He's gonna head back to the line to do it again. A 
Another big serve. Tide looking to save that ball, but coming off a little bit spinning is that second contact. Point Scotia Juniors. Dimitris Kariakis with the serve. And that ball passed up by Jack Maddie. A tip over from the middle. Big defense there by the Scotia Juniors as they put it back over. Swing from the left side is Hatfield. And that swing is going to score, but not without some great defensive attempts there from the Scotia Junior side. Alex Field back to serve. That ball passed up and over, taken by the hands of the Tide player. Swing in the middle from Crow, and that is going to score. Back on the line here now, Alex Field with the serve for Tide. Kariakis with the first contact. That ball set up, tipped over by Curry. Big defense by Cullen. Swing in the middle this time from Bartlett. And that is going to score for the Scotia Juniors. Back on the line. Here is Craig Bartlett with the serve. Short serve picked up by the Tide. And it is a bump kill for Drew Williams. A good job there not giving up on that ball and putting it back over. Tide server now, number nine, Eric Fields, back at the line. And it is a service ace. Tide now past the 20 point mark, looking to close out this first set with some authority from the back line. Big serve. Big chase down from the Scotia Juniors. Looking to put that one over, but just a little bit shy. Not without some incredible effort there from Dimitri Kariakis. Eric Fields back to serve. And it is a service ace. And it looks like we are going to see a timeout call called once again here by the Scotia Juniors Volleyball Club. Both teams looking to come back on the court here at the Nova Scotia Champs 2019 Weekend 1 from the Canada Game Centre in Halifax, Nova Scotia. The Tide with a nice lead now here in this first set, 23-7. to seven. And heading back to the line to serve here is Tide's number 9, Eric Fields. That serve hitting the top of the tape. A nice coach's point there, breaking that tough serve. And that's going to send Scotia Juniors number 11, Philip Cullen, back to the line to serve. And that one just dropping short point tied as they are now at set point here as Bradley Hatfield heads back to serve. And it is a service ace to win the game. There you have it, folks. The Tide of Volleyball 14U Boys Club has taken the first set 
but don't go anywhere. We'll be right back for the second one to see what will happen. Hello everyone, welcome back to the Nova Scotia Champs 2019 Weekend One here at the Canada Game Center. My name is Raisa Lalani and I have got your call for all of the games this weekend. Super excited to be here with you. And we have the Tide Volleyball 14U Boys Club taking on the Scotia Juniors Volleyball 14U Boys Club. Tide taking the first set and now we are right in the mix of the second. And it looks like we have started off with a 1-1 battle here on the court. Heading back to serve for Scotia Juniors, this is number 12, Will Kennedy. And that serve just sliding out of bounds, point going to Tide. Back on the line here for the Tide side, it is number eight, Jack Maddie. And that ball is going to land inbounds, point tied. Captain Jack Maddy back to serve again. That one over the tape, picked up by Scotia Juniors. A nice back row attack there from Jack Kersey. Free ball over. Another free ball from the Scotia Juniors. Tide looking to set that ball. That one just going behind him. Scotia Juniors point. And heading back to serve here now, number three. Once again, Jack Kersey.
And that is a big serve. That one landing out of bounds. A little swing in the miss there from the passer, but definitely worth it as it did land out of bounds. Point tied. Back on the line, number two, Travis McAndrew. And that ball is passed up. A good try there from the second touch. But that one just a little too low to get over. Point tied. Travis McAndrew serving the ball again. That one going into the pole. That is going to be a point for Scotia Juniors. Graham O'Brien back to serve here now for the Scotia Juniors. And it looks like the referee's off the stand. Looks like that ball hit the padding on the pole, just making sure that it stays safe for these players on the court. Scotia Juniors serving the ball. Here is Graham O'Brien. That ball is passed up, set to the middle. A tip from the middle out of bounds and a very nice track there from Jeremy Curry to make sure it was out of bounds before trying to play it. Scotia Juniors point. O'Brien back to serve. That ball passed up by McMillan. Free ball coming over from Spence. Free ball over from Groves, but it didn't quite make it. That one is going to be a point for the Tide. Heading back to serve here for the Tide now is Liam Ricks. And that ball's passed up by Curry. Up and over, a little bit of a joust at the net. And a tip over there. A good job there from Levi Spence trying to put that one over. But it looks like we're going to get a call from the referee landing on the tied side. And that is going to send Nathan Groves back to serve. That one a little bit short point tied. Serving the ball here for the Tide side, Bowen McMillan. That one is going to go into the net point, Scotia Juniors. Heading back to serve here is Peter Skinner. A tight battle here in this second set, six serving seven. That ball is passed up, set to the left, a big swing from number eight, Jack Matty. Tide point. Back on the line here is LaBelle. That ball passed up by O'Brien, but just a little too far outside of the court for a second contact. That is gonna be a point for Tide. LaBelle with the serve again, a service ace. Point tied. Simon LaBelle with his third serve in a row. That ball is passed up by Kersey, but no one there to get that second contact. Another service ace. Simon LaBelle looking to widen the gap here in the second set for his team. And that one is going to land out of bounds. Point going to Scotia Juniors.
Back on the line, Isaac Crow with the serve. That ball is passed up, tipped over. A little bit of a tight set there from the Scotia Junior side. Got to stay safe, can't go under the net. So that's going to be a tied point. And there is a serve from Levi Spence. And we are going to see a double contact called on that pass. And that is a rule here in the 14U age category that you have to pass the ball with your platform, not with your hands. And that's just to promote learning the skill, the skill of passing, which is tough. And a good scramble play there from the Scotia Juniors, but that is going to be a tied ball. And a short serve over, passed up by O'Brien. That ball hit over. Tied looking to save it cross court, and he does. And we get a fist pump off of that one. There is a competitor right there. That is your captain, Jack Maddy, for the Tide side with the great save. And folks, if you need any information about this championship going on, head over to volleyballnovascotia.ca. Right on the homepage, there is a news link called Nova Scotia Champs 2019 Volleyball. It has all the information for you about the schedule, the results, the venue, social media. Of course, you know about the live streaming if you have found us here on 360 Live. Anything you need to know, there's lots of information. And there is also an instructional video of scorekeeping, which is really great. Parents out there, if you're coming to support and watch in person, take a look at that video. We always need scorekeepers to come and help out. So once again, volleyballnovascotia.ca. Set for Tide, and a reminder, the Tide did take the first set. But lots of volleyball action still to be played here. Heading back to the line to start it all off again, here is Levi Spence. And that ball is going to land right in the corner of the court. Point going to Tide. Service ace. And it looks like we're going to get the whistle blown right after that serve was contacted. A foot violation, which means that the server's foot touched the red line. The red lines are the lines of the court here at the Canada Game Centre. So that is going to be a Scotia Juniors point. And it looks like another tight call there. Another line violation, this time on the Scotia Juniors side. Good job by the head referee keeping these guys honest to make sure they develop the skills properly that they need heading back to serve on the tide side here is maddie and that is a big service ace for maddie point tied maddie with the serve that ball passed up by curry Set to the left and a swing on that ball, just hitting the top of the tape, point tied. Maddie back to serve. And that one is going to land between two players, a nicely placed serve in the seam, point tied. There's another big serve, that one passed up by Curry. Free ball over from Kiersey, picked up by the Tide. And there is a big block in the middle from the Scotia Junior side. Jack Kersey getting up there, not letting that ball come back onto his side. And after that heads up play, he's gonna head back to serve. Float serve, passed up. But no one there to get the second ball, but a good chase down there by the back row of the Tide. 
That is going to be a service ace for the Scotia Juniors. Both teams in the double digits. Scotia Juniors looking to climb back into this one. 10 serving 20. And there is another big serve picked up by the Tide Passer. And a free ball put over from McMillan. And there is a big block, but not big enough. A good job there by number two. It's Peter Skinner with that free ball kill off of the blocker's hands. Serve from Jack here. See that one going into the net. Heading back on the tied side to serve here is Travis McAndrew. That one's going to land out of bounds off the side of the court. Scotia Juniors point. Graham O'Brien back to serve now. And that is going to be a point for the tie. That one not quite making it over. Tide heading back to serve. Back on the line here is Liam Ricks. That ball passed up by Curry. An attempt there with a little bit of a tough angle for Peter Skinner, but good job trying to be aggressive in hitting that ball. Liam Ricks back to serve. That ball is passed up. Free ball over from Kiersey. But unfortunately, just a little bit short of the tape. That's going to be a point for the Tide. Tide looking to close out this set. 24-12 here with Liam Ricks on the back line. Big serve. Passed up by O'Brien. A great save there, but not quite making it over the tape from the Scotia Juniors and the Tide. 14 new boys are going to claim that first game two sets to zero. Well, folks, you were watching the Nova Scotia Championship 2019 Weekend 1. Don't go anywhere. We're going to be back with a lot of action all day today. 14 new boys on this court. Thanks for tuning in. We'll be back.